So tell them, what's your type? Sit down. What's my type? Yeah, I got... <laughs> Those are shorts, not boxers. Oh, okay. So what's your type? Um, guys are tall. Okay. Um, loyal. Okay, heavy on loyal, facts. And respectful. Respectful, okay, yes. okay. Like, what catch your attention like, physical wise type shit? Um... Like, like black, Hispanics, white, Chinese, Indians, you know what I mean? Oh, like what race? I, I don't really, I don't really care about that, but I mainly just dated Mexicans because like most of the people, I don't really go out, so I don't really uh-huh. meet guys. You don't be going out? No, so whenever I meet a guy, it's through mutual friends, you know? So the only boyfriends I've had have been through mutual friends and they okay. just happen to be Mexican. And, um, but that doesn't mean that I only date Mexicans. Okay. How much does a guy have to make a year to fuck with you? I've, I've, I've never paid attention to that. Okay. I think as long as you're, like, even in the Bible it says the guy's supposed to be the protector and provider. Yeah, like, yeah. as long as, like, they don't have to be super rich to be a protector and provider. Okay. Like, my dad was broke and he was still protector and provider for my mom, you know? Mm-hmm. So, as Wait, long as you're a protector. You have a dad in your life? Yeah, my parents have been together since they were teenagers. You don't have a dad? Oh. You have a mom? Yeah, she did, she did. My mom is my mom and dad at once. So you were raised by a single mom? Yeah. Facts, facts, facts. So what happened if you met what happened if like a regular guy, let's say a regular barber. A barber just come, you go to the deli or some shit, you run into him, he runs down, you think he's cute and everything, but you find out he's just a barber, he don't really make that much. But he trying. I think as long as uh, it's not a guy that expects me to take care of him, yeah, of course. then it's good. Because that okay. would not be anyone's sugar mama. Like, okay. I feel like that's for like old ladies. Do you like guys with clout or no clout? I prefer if they have no clout. Okay. Because there's less drama, they don't think they're the princess in the relationship, they're not conceited and self-absorbed, and like, they treat me better than someone who thinks they have to receive the princess treatment. What's an ick that you got? When a guy's very arrogant and like full of himself and like that's, you see, that's, you see, that's, that's an it for me. Okay, okay. That's good. Huh? What? That's an it. <laughs> that's just good, like good. Oh, like when a guy looks at a girl. Oh yeah, that would be a nick for me too. Like yeah, if I have a boyfriend. That's disrespectful. Yeah, if I have a boyfriend and a girl has like like almost breaks his neck, yeah, that's an ick too. Bad calling me. Should I pick up? Nah. <laughs> what's your, wait, what's your type? My type, I like Spanish girls. Um, like only Spanish girls? That's the only nah, race you think? No, no, I had, you know, I had a black girl once. I've been like one white girl, but it was mostly Spanish. I love Colombians. Like, for me, I like. To go to my country a lot, so it's like I rather just us go together. Oh, I forgot you're Colombian. Yeah, so it's like, I go to Colombia a lot, so I like me Colombian, but also I be around my Dominicans, so I like Dominicans. I never had a Mexican. Like the Mexicans compared to LA and New York are completely opposites. They're mad different. So, oh, I think because of Mexican girls in New York, they're from Mexico City. I have no idea. Yes, I I know because I've been to New York and all the Mexican people I met there, they're from Mexico City. And in Mexico City is different than being from like Sinaloa or Guadalajara, you know? Like, so where do you think the baddies at? So when I go to Mexico, I'm going to go. Sinaloa and Jalisco. Okay, you be going there a lot? Mm-hmm. When's the last time you went to Mexico? Nah, fuck that. When's the last time a guy flew you out? Uh, what? <laughs> well, I would just got out of a relationship. Oh, uh, really? Like, three weeks ago. Three? Damn, what happened? You don't want me asking. Um, so... It was just like the situation you just said now. He didn't really like have money and like I didn't okay. care and I gave him a chance like even though he didn't have money. And then yeah. he still had the audacity to say that I wasn't humble when I was riding around in his Nissan. And like, okay, you in a Nissan? I have a pink okay. G-Wagon and yeah. I would be in, in, his, Nissan? in his Nissan. Okay, I'm and like, I was like, okay, how old would you say I'm not humble when I'm literally like, with you in your Nissan and I accepted to be your girlfriend and I don't, he was very insecure yeah. like every time I would go out he would be like oh I know you like this guy or that guy like if any guy was around me he can't he, mention too many other people he would get jealous of my contractor of the fucking mailman of uh, my of uh, the workers at my house the construction like workers like me. he was jealous of any guy around me like he didn't uh-huh. want any guy around me like I could be with a cousin I'm like oh it's my cousin no I know your cousin likes you like what 
Like, he just thought yeah. every guy around me liked me and that I was going to cheat on him with everyone. So I'd be like, okay, so if you think I'm going to cheat on you with everyone, then you think I'm a hoe. So why are you dating me if you okay. think I'm a hoe? Okay. He'd be like, no, I don't think you're a hoe, but I think it's the guys that I don't trust. And I'm like, so you want me to live in a bubble with like no man? Like that doesn't exist, you know? What, so that was a problem. Mean? Like you, he wants me to live in a bubble where like in a world with no men. In a world with no men doesn't okay. exist. Like wherever I go, if I go to Target, there's gonna be guys. You know, wherever I go, there's gonna be guys. In this world, there's guys and girls. So it was just a constant draining fight of like him wanting me to just be home all the time. And I would be home all the time. I don't party, I don't drink, I don't go out. No. So the only times I do go out, it would be a problem for him when I would work. So it's like you're not paying my bills, why aren't you letting me work? You know? Yeah, five, five, Hi Ali! Okay, okay, okay. Sorry, I got mad. It's because it's. Nah, I ain't gonna lie to that. I just see that you. That shit just hit you. All right. I got a question. I got a good question for you. All right. Yeah, let me think. Dude. I need one more person. Fuck. Matter of fact, let's do it. I don't know the third person, but fuck it. All right. Smash, Mary, kill. Okay. Lalo. Oh, don't do me, that. You can't. Lalo's like my brother. You can't put Lalo in there. What you mean is none of that. Lalo, no, Juanito, and no, me. No, I'm not doing that. I wouldn't want to kill Lalo because he's like my I don't brother. Know, I don't know people that you know. Okay. I wouldn't want to kill Ah, matter of fact. Listen, listen. I would not want to kill Lalo because he's like my best friend and my brother. And I would not want to marry Lalo because he's, he's like my brother. And I would not want to smash Lalo because he's like my brother. So you can't put me in this situation. I feel like one day you're going to catch some interest for Lalo. No. That's so? like saying, oh, one day you're going to catch feelings for your sister. No, it just doesn't work that way. No. I, don't, I think I think one day you're gonna be like. No. no. How old are you again? How old are you? I'm 21. You're 21? Yeah. Oh my god, they're older. No. How old are you? I'm 21. You're 21? I'm just kidding, no. How old are you? I don't wanna see my age because then everyone starts talking shit. Alright, here, tape it, but don't. Nah? No, but I've been to New York because I have friends in New York, but. You already like it? It's so far. Imagine having a boyfriend in New York and flying from here all the way to New York. You want to do long distance? Dang, you don't believe in real love like that? Well, the last guy I had, he was back and forth between Mexico and here, so it was kind of like that. How long is that? Well, uh, the flight to yeah. Mexico? Uh, from here to Guadalajara, it's like three hours. That's scary. It's not that long. That's valid. All right. Smash, Mary kill. Kasanet, Duke Dennis. I don't know who Duke Dennis is. Let me Google him. Thank God. Thank God. This is Duke Dennis? Yeah. Okay. Him or Phantom? Who? Phantom. Who's that? Phantom. I've heard of that one because yeah. my, I think my brother mentions him, but. Oh, okay, I see him. You didn't give me a good choice at all. Damn. You said smash, marry, kill? Yeah. I wouldn't smash or marry any of them, but I still kill all of you. Nah. 